All right, guys, I'm going to show you how to connect an iMeave to Hob Drive via the OBD Link LX connector. All right. One of the first things I didn't realize was I have to choose the proper profile in Hob Drive. So you go to Screens, go to Settings. And in OBD port settings, of course, you're going to choose the correct one, which is the OBD Link LX. And I leave everything as default for this. And I hit save. That's the easy part. But then the next part is you have to go down to vehicle settings. And up here, you can choose Mitsubishi. But and the year, but under the type, under the model, it's only OBD2. So that's the only option you have. What I didn't realize is under ECU settings, you have to choose the manufacturer. So you choose here and you go down to Mitsubishi. Um, and then you choose the particular model and I have the wrong one chosen right now I need the Mitsubishi iMeave Li-Ion I was choosing I don't know why I chose that I thought I was choosing this earlier but okay Li-Ion that's the correct one I have a JDM I'm not sure if I need this I haven't chosen it yet I'll test it out later but right now I'm using none of these options. Okay, so I'm going to hit OK. And let's see if it goes back. Yes. Go back to vehicle settings. And hit OK. All right, and go back to settings. Okay, now here's how it's best to do it. You, you, the handshaking on this is very short. The window, the handshaking window is very short. So I plug it in with the narrow side closest to the driver. So I go up underneath the dash and plug it in. As soon as I plug it in, I turn on the ignition and I go to screens. Sorry, I go to actions. And I hit reconnect. And let's see what happens. Am I connected? Looks like I might be connected here. So let's go to screens. Go to diagnostics. No DTCs found. That's good. It's screens. Let's check out uh one of the battery pages voltage cmu pages okay so i am getting metrics loaded here let's rotate this looks good looks like i'm getting something okay so <clears throat> looks like i'm connected here general page trip computer no fuel in this EV, no tank. All right, let's go to screens and let's see, what do we want? Maybe we want MCU. Should populate, yep. Good, all right. And then we can go to Hmm, all volt, let's see, all cell volt, let's see what we get. So anyway, it's working, and it is connected. And let's see what else we got. EV, ECU, 350 volt, looks good. Yeah, so that's how you do it, capacity measure. No, I don't want to 
do that right now. Uh, hmm. What do I want? 88 volt BMU? 88 cell volt BMU. Right, so this, this car has 88 cells. When I had it set to the wrong profile, for the IME van, that had 117. That's why it was incorrect. This is a 2011 IME standard K car. K. Evil BMU. Here's the 88 diagram BMU. One takes a little while. This one's actually the slowest screen to populate in Hob Drive. Anyway, it looks like. <clears throat> Uh, it's working and that's how you connect so um, it's like a good good cell temperatures I'm not sure what is important to show here. Looks like I got twelve CMUs. I didn't think there were that many modules. Sensor list. Got quite a few sensors. I just got a fast scan mode. Let's see if that works. Yeah, I can turn the water pump on. Turn it off. That's pretty cool. Um, drive efficiency. Yeah, I haven't gone anywhere. Guess that's it. That doesn't work. All right. Anyway, that's how you connect. You look at the screens on Hub Drive. Thanks, guys. Hope that helped.